welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're going to be doing craft time with Dora. So I'm going to show you how to make these paper roses. I made them out of old books. So let's get started. So the first thing that you're going to need is a book, some scissors, and some hair ties. Yep, this is my book. So now just start to tear out the pages. I tore out about five at once so I could just cut them all at once so it'd be a little bit faster. So now that you have your pages, you're going to start cutting them. I cut them into a heart, but make sure they're not perfect because roses, the petals aren't really perfect. And there you go. I cut some sideways and the long ways, so hot dog style and Sunday style. So I'd have bigger petals and smaller ones as well. Yep, and there are the bigger petals. And now you just want to curl them. Oh, don't do it like that. Just curl the edges of the petals so they flare out a little bit. And you want to do this for all of the petals. Mm -hmm. And you want to curl mm -hmm. it away from you so you don't accidentally cut yourself. That'd be bad. So for each flower, it depends how many petals you want. Mm -hmm. It all depends mm -hmm. on how big or how small you want the flower to be. I used about maybe eight per flower. So now you just want to curl the ends of the petal into like a little tube, and then you want to pinch it, just like that. Then you want to get another one and curl it around that, and then pinch it as well. This is going to be the inner part of the flower. Then you want to grab one hair tie, and then just tie it all together so it doesn't come undone. You could also cut the end of it so it's not as long. The end of the paper, not the hair tie. All right, and then you're gonna grab more petals and then just start wrapping them around again. It depends how big you want the center of the flower to be. So just do as many as you like. All right, that looks pretty good. And then you wanna grab some more petals, maybe some of the bigger ones, and then just start layering them around that inner center of the flower. And then you just want to pinch them all together at the bottom so they kind of flare out like a real rose would. Yep, like that. And you just want to keep adding as many as you like. I'm making kind of a big flower, that's why I'm adding more. And there you go. Now you just want to tie it off with another little hair tie and just pinch it all together and tie it. And there you go. You're done. It's a quick and easy way to make some book paper flowers and you don't have to waste your time using glue. They're pretty, don't you think? Give it a like below if you liked the tutorial. And you're all done. Thank you so much for watching this week's video. Stay tuned next Wednesday for another video. Thanks for watching this video. Bye. See you next Wednesday.